Second set. Sir. <clears throat> Begin. One. Sir. sir. Two. two. Sir. sir. Three. Sir. Four. Sir. sir. Five. Sir. Six. Sir. Seven. Sir. Eight. Sir. Eight. sir. Nine. Sir. Ten. Sir. Notice that um, coming to Kung Fu is the same way. We're you want to make sure that you're still doing it twice a week, four times a week, however, how often you're briefly doing it. Um, because what we, what I've at least seen is that when we have students that they start doing this thing where it's like, I'll go it once every other week, that eventually they just stop doing it. Mm -hmm. um, just because it's kind of like one of those things where either you lose interest or it's just like you have fallen out of the routine. For me, it was just like every weeknight. It's like I need to go. That's yeah. just my thing. It definitely helped me when I was at home. Like that was like the only normal thing I had going on. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> you know, because I wasn't working. All right, that was the only way to tell what day it was. Really. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I have class today. So. Yes, it's class today. It's yeah. It's it's weird, and especially when they talk about like. Everybody wants to go back to normal. It's like, well, there is no, there is not going to be any normal. This is, <laughs> there's going to be somewhere in between will be the new normal. Yeah. 
normal was never really normal. <laughs> what, uh, what were they talking about like that with the, with the stock market? Where it's like, mm. it's just going to go up forever. And it's like, no. no. <laughs> our life, and this is our lifestyle. And everybody keeps saying our lifestyle is unsustainable. Yep. <laughs> All right. Well, that's set. Sir. <clears throat> Begin. One. Sir. sir. Two. Sir. sir. Three. Sir. sir. Four. Sir. sir. Five, sir. Six, Six sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. All right. On your back for bicycle crunches or piston kicks. Sir, from the earlier class. All right. First set of 25. Sir. Begin. One, sir. Two, sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. 11, sir. 12, sir. 13, sir. 14, sir. 15, sir. 16, sir. 17, sir. 18, sir. 19, sir. 20, sir. 1, sir. 2, sir. 3, sir. 4, sir. 5, sir. Rest. Sir. Second set. Yes, sir. Begin. One, sir. Two, Two sir. Three, Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Eleven, sir. Twelve, sir. Thirteen, sir. Fourteen, sir. Fifteen, sir. Sixteen, sir. Seventeen, sir. Eighteen, sir. Nineteen, sir. Twenty, sir. One, sir. Two, sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Rest. Last set. Yes, sir. Begin. One, sir. Two, sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Eleven, sir. Twelve, sir. Thirteen, sir. Fourteen, sir. Fifteen, sir. Sixteen, sir. Seventeen, sir. Eighteen, sir. Nineteen, sir. Twenty, sir. One, sir. Two, sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Sit up. Yes, sir. Um, that one feels a little bit more difficult than normal. Uh, that wasn't a mistake. We uh, we slowed down quite a bit. Um, the slower you go with those, the much harder they get. Yes, sir. But it's good for you. Yes, sir. It's it's helping. It's helping you build up your core. All right. Feet straight out in front. Yes, Reach up, bend forward, touch your toes. Yes, sir. One, sir. Two, sir. Three, Three sir. Four, sir. Five, Five sir. Six, sir. sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Eleven, sir. Twelve, sir. Thirteen, sir. Fourteen, sir. Fifteen, sir. Sixteen, sir. Seventeen, sir. Eighteen, sir. Nineteen, sir. Twenty, sir. Big one leg in. Sir. Reach up. Bend forward. Touch your toes. Yes, sir. One, sir. Two, sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Eleven, sir. Twelve, sir. Thirteen, sir. 14, sir. 15, sir. 16, sir. 17, sir. 18, sir. 19, sir. 20, sir. Switch sides, sir. Reach up. Bend forward, touch your toes. Sir. 1, sir. 2, sir. 3, sir. 4, sir. 5, sir. 6, sir. 7, sir. 8, sir. 9, sir. 10, sir. 11, sir. 12, sir. 13, sir. 14, sir. 15, sir. 16, sir. 17, sir. 18, sir. 19, sir. 20, sir. Right bottoms and feet together. Sir. Oh no, did I fall asleep during the stomach crunches? Bicycle crunches? Okay. 
Is it we're, frozen? We're about, we're about three minutes behind. <laughs> we started on time, I think. It's hard to tell. Yeah. All right, push the knees down, back straight, head held high. Bend forward, touch your nose to your toes, or as low as you can go. Sir. One, sir. Two, Two sir. Three, three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, Nine sir. Ten, ten, sir. Eleven, sir. Twelve, sir. Thirteen, sir. Fourteen, sir. Fifteen, sir. Sixteen, sir. Seventeen, sir. Eighteen, sir. Nineteen, sir. Twenty, sir. Sit up. Yes, sir. Feet wide apart. Sit. I know I talk about how colder months make this uh, make this more difficult. Um, if you're not active, <laughs> that also makes it more difficult. Um, hey kids, stay active. <laughs> uh, it's, I know it's gonna be a lot harder, um, especially with uh, everybody staying at home. Um, yeah, it's definitely a lot harder because um, I know you have your school activities, your school activities. Um, you, do, you get to be more active and pretty much you do it every day, but now that you're probably at home, I don't know how many of you are actually remaining active during the day. Um, but uh, it's a good idea to every now and then just go outside and be a little bit more active. All right. Hands up. One, sir. Two, Two sir. Three, three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Eleven, sir. 12, sir, 13, sir, 14, sir, 15, sir, 16, sir, 17, sir, 18, sir, 19, sir, 20, sir. Reach to one side, sir. Reach to the other side, sir. Reach to both sides, sir. Wide your stretch if you can. Set your head to the floor as low as it'll go. Yes, sir. One, sir. Two, Two sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Eleven, sir. Twelve, sir. Thirteen, sir. Fourteen, sir. Fifteen, sir. Sixteen, sir. Seventeen, sir. Eighteen, sir. Nineteen, sir. Twenty, sir. All right, we're going to lift up and turn towards your right. Yes, sir. There's no seating at home. <laughs> I have a script. Um, that I normally keep to whenever we're in class. This is no longer applicable. One, sir. Two, two sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Eleven, sir. Twelve, sir. Thirteen, sir. Fourteen, sir. Fifteen, sir. Sixteen, sir. Seventeen, sir. Eighteen, sir. Nineteen, sir. Twenty, sir. Switch sides. One, sir. Two, sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Eleven, sir. Twelve, sir. Thirteen, sir. Fourteen, sir. Fifteen, sir. Sixteen, sir. Seventeen, sir. Eighteen, sir. Nineteen, sir. Twenty, sir. We're going to go back to center. Sir. We're going to push up one, two, three, and I'm going to walk back. I'm going to lose my splits club patches. <laughs> Oh, I'm having a sad now. All right, hands up. One, sir. Two, sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Eleven, sir. Twelve, sir. Thirteen, sir. Fourteen, sir. Fifteen, sir. Sixteen, sir. Seventeen, sir. Eighteen, sir. Nineteen, sir. Twenty, sir. Feet straight out in front, sir. Reach up. Bend forward. Touch your toes, sir. sir. One, sir. Two, two sir. Three, sir. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Eleven, sir. Twelve, sir. Thirteen, sir. Fourteen, sir. Fifteen, sir. Sixteen, sir. Seventeen, sir. Eighteen, sir. Nineteen, sir. Twenty, sir. All right, we're gonna go on to our backs, sir. And we're gonna bridge up, yes, sir. And back down. Sure. Hook your knees, we're gonna rock backwards. Forwards. Oh, oh great. Push it out. Any additional stretch. Oh wow. Our three minutes behind have become six minutes behind. I apologize. <laughs> I don't know how that has happened. Okay, let's get through this really quick. Um we did not cover all of our crane stances last time. 
Okay, so we only made it up to our cross stance. So um, today I want to finish off our crane stances. So we're going to review everything that we've already done. So we're going to review our um, crane breathing. We're going to review the, the stances that we learned all the way up to the cross stance. And then we are going to learn the rest of the crane stances. Okay. So let's start with our crane breathing. Yes, sir. Stand, stance. Yes, sir. Stand tall. Yes, yes sir. Stay tight. Hey. Stay tight. Hands up. Look left. Back to center. One. Two. Three. Push. Get all of it out. One. Two. Three. Push. Last one. One. Two, three, push, jump, down up, feet together. Yes, sir. All right. Two, two more times. Stand, stand. Yes, stand. yes, sir. Stand tall. Yes, sir. Stay okay, tight. Stay okay. tight. Hands up. Look left. Back to center. One, two, three. Push. One. Two. Three. Push. One. Two. Three. Push. Jump. Down up. Beat up. Sir. Last one. Pinch. Dance. Sir, stand tall. Yes, yes sir. sir. Stay, stay tight. Stay tight. Hands up. Look left. Back to center. One. Two. Three. Push. One. Two. Three. Push. One. Two. Three. Push. Hold it up. Jump. Down up. Feet together. Yes, sir. Good. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> Feel that lung capacity. Yes, sir. It's um, this is one of those ones where when I first started doing this, it hurt a lot. <laughs> <laughs> it was it was difficult to do. Um, uh, but the longer you do it, the, the more you kind of hold that breath, the, 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 the easier it's going to get. If you, <coughs> uh, if you ever spent your summers at a swimming pool with friends, uh, one of the things that a lot of kids do is you see how long you can hold your breath underwater. And so that's another form of just basically trying to teach yourself to either increase that lung capacity or kind of shut off that uh, reflex that forces you want to breathe <laughs> while you're underwater. Um, and sometimes that, that urge just to overcome you. This is just kind of this is one of those ones where it's it's that same kind of thing where you're trying to increase that lung capacity. Yes, sir. All right, let us move on to our crane stance. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Review the ones we've already done. Hands and stance. Yes, yes sir. sir. Stand tall. Yes, yes sir. sir. High crane. High crane. Middle crane. Middle crane. Low crane. Low crane. Monkey top. Monkey top. Bow stance left. Bow stance left. Okay. Cross stance right. Cross stance right. This is about as far as we got. Our next move, we're just going to unwind and clap. Okay. So there's no callback on this one. We're just going to come up and clap. All right. We're going to do one more move, and then we're going to re-review everything. Okay. So for our next move, we're going to do another bow stance left. We're going to take that left foot. We're going to step it behind us. And as we turn, we're going to strike with our hands, okay? Sir. Your right hand should be on top, your left hand should be on the bottom. Good. You should feel that for a little bit. So as you're turning, you should feel that that's a strike. Sir. You should be able to feel that power. That a lot of that's, that, that should not be coming from your arms, you should feel that actually coming from your hips. Sir. Cool. Yeah. So, um, reset. Sure. Uh, 
a lot of the stuff that we do, you, you don't really understand what it does until after you've kind of done that application or you've actually done the move. So um, I want to say the first time I went through Crane Stances, I didn't understand what any of this did. We were just doing this with our arms. But um, all of all this all this movement actually has a purpose. It's certain. Um, and you're going to see this a lot with like wushu, of course. Like wushu get a lot of flourish. Um, they've taken a lot of the martial arts out of wushu, um, but it kind of has that still has that roots of they're still practicing something that was a martial art, but they were trying to hide it through dance. Because that's what a lot of this is. It looks like we're not doing anything. We're just pretending to be animals. <laughs> <laughs> but it was it was it was, it was uh, intended to hide the fact that you were practicing martial arts. Yes, sir. Okay. Let's do that again. Stand. Stand. Yes, sir. Stand tall. Yes, sir. High crane. High crane. Middle crane. Middle crane. Low crane. Low crane. Monkey hop. Monkey hop. Bow stance left. Bow stance left. Cross stance right. Cross stance right. Clap. Keep turning the same way. Bow stance left. Bow stance left. Okay. So our next one's going to be our crane stance right. Okay. So when we do our crane stance right, we're going to be doing our traditional crane stance. But instead of our hands being here, they're going to be at an angle. And you should be able to feel this. Um, I know we've got the mirrors here in the, in the class um, at the school, where we can actually see that our arms are, are straight. You can check that, because um, we don't want to be in kind of a weird position. Because that's what happens when you, <laughs> when you can't actually check. Yes, sir. You wind up with your arms something like this. Um, just double check. Your arms are straight, but not straight, bent, but not. Sure. Okay. So they should have a slight bend. So um, and as you get better at this, so this is going to be, this is going to be just like what we normally do with our crane stance. You find a spot on the wall, and you're focusing on that spot on the wall. You're going to have a little bit of a bend in that knee. Don't lock that knee completely out. And then that other leg is just protecting your kneecap. Yes, sir. Right. Now, as you get better at this, and your balance gets better, because this is traditionally a, it's a balanced exercise, you will no longer be looking at the wall. You look down to your right. At your right hand. Yes, sir. And you'll feel <laughs> the first time you do it, you're gonna feel a little unstable. Yes, sir. Okay. Um, uh, switch your hands. Maybe just to put it off. Yeah, down to the right. Yes. Practice that just a little bit at home. Yeah. That's the that's the more advanced. So, um, from what I understand, traditionally our our crane unit was a red dash and up hmm. class. Um, originally, so now we've kind of like rolled it back into the basics. So we could, there's a lot more stuff that's just that much harder. <laughs> okay, let's do that again. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Stand tall. Yes, yes sir. sir. High crane. High crane. Middle crane. Middle crane. Low crane. Low, Low crane. Monkey hop. Monkey hop. Bow stance left. Bow stance left. Cross stance right. Cross stance right. Clap. Bow stance left. Bow stance left. Crane stance right. Crane stance right. Okay. Now our next one's going to be our dragon stance right. When we do this, there's going to be a little bit of a hop. A hop, and we're going to drop down into our dragon stance. Okay. And our hands are going to be pretty much the same as they were with our crane stance. But our legs are now in our Right. Yes, sir. Okay. And we're going to shift all of our weight back to the center. So we can keep together. Yes, sir. Okay. Um, so I'm, I'm giving you guys kind of a, a little bit of a um, a little bit of a helper there on that one. Because um, a lot of times I will, or it's a, kind of a correction, or if it's a cleanup. Simply because I see so many students that once they're here, they'll, they'll wind up doing it. This, you know, which is awkward. Um, or a lot of times, what'll happen is like a lot of students will actually fall over trying to get up. Yes, sir. Um, so the the best way to get out of this is actually to shift all of your weight onto both legs and come straight out. Yes, sir. Um, 
it takes a lot of strength to come out of that long one leg. Yes, sir. <laughs> it's very true. Um, and, and you don't have to do that. You don't have to put yourself through that pain. And a lot of times the students, when they try to do it off that one leg, they, they fail pretty miserably. So, yes, sir. So, so unless you're able to actually come up out of that off of one leg, the best thing to do is actually shift all of your weight to the center and then come up from the center. All right? Sir. Okay. Reset. Let's do that entire thing. Stand stance. Yes, yes, sir. Stand tall. Yes, yes sir. High yes, crane. High crane. Little crane. Little crane. Little crane. Little crane. Monkey hop. Monkey hop. Bow stance left. Bow stance left. Cross stance right. Cross stance right. Clap. Keep turning the same way. Bow stance left. Bow stance left. Crane stance right. Crane stance right. Drag stance right. Drag stance right. Feet together. Yes, sir. That's right. Did that help? Yes, sir. <laughs> it's a lot easier. It's a lot easier. Okay. Sometimes I cover it in class, sometimes I don't. Um, usually it's like oh, once I see students are struggling coming out of it, I'll cover it. I should probably cover it every time. <laughs> I cover different things every time. Yes, sir. So, so it's, um, sometimes I don't know. I don't know what it is that I need to cover until I actually see students in class. We're gonna do it two more times. We're gonna do the whole thing two more times, um, sir. and then we'll probably be out of time at that point. Okay, sir. Stand, stand. Yes, yes, sir. Stand tall. Yes, yes sir. High crane. High crane. Middle crane. Middle crane. Low crane. Low crane. Monkey hop. Monkey hop. Bow stance left. Bow stance left. Cross stance right. Cross stance right. Clap. Bow stance left. Bow stance left. Crane stance right. Crane stance right. Dragon stance right. Dragon stance right. Yes, sir. Reset. Yes, sir. Left. Pigeon stance. Yes, sir. Stand tall. Yes, sir. High crane. High crane. Middle crane. Middle crane. Low crane. Low crane. Monkey hop. Monkey hop. Bow stance left. Bow stance left. Cross stance right. Cross stance right. Clap. Keep turning the same way. Bow stance left. Bow stance left. Crane stance right. Crane stance right. Dragon stance. Dragon stance right. Feet together. Sir. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, slide up. Sir. Sir. I knew it was no square. Yeah, no, it's. <laughs> I said you would fall over, it's students fall over. It's okay. It's a. Uh, it gets a lot harder when you go fast. It's a lot harder. Like, significantly. <laughs> <laughs> and it doesn't take that much. It's like 5% faster is a lot harder. Sir. All right. Um, that's why there's usually like a pace I set it at. Um, and that's not the fastest we've gone with that. Yeah. <laughs> next time we'll go faster. Yes, sir. Sure. We'll go a lot faster on it. And then uh, next time we'll also go over our blocks. We'll probably get the first two blocks in, um, which will be our crane high block and our crane inside block. Yes. All right. Let's bow out. Sir. Sure. We follow the five parts faith, respect, perseverance. Patience and humility. Bow to head instructor. Bow to beginner level students and everybody at home. All right, basically, dismiss.